Alright, hey, what's up everyone? Rough David21 here, and today we are back with another video. And this time it's not an exposed question or a um what would happen if the sub if a sub battle occurred. But I've been having very much problems. I've been seeing a lot of these videos from ZDL Vlogs on YouTube. He's been he's been trying to expose I'm J Station, he's been trying to call him fake, and and yeah, I've really had some big problems with you, ZDL. If you're watching this, stop calling JStation fake, okay? I've had enough of it. You're being really irritating. You can't... You can't just... Why don't you just stick to your own thing? And then... And then just leave leave the J Nation be. Leave, leave be the J Nation. Or... Or I will tell JStation in the comments to take down the ZDL squad, and you think I won't do it, do you? You think I won't do it? I'll just bet I'll do it after this video. But you really need to stop calling somebody else fake. If won't, but ZDL, it's very disappointing how you're calling someone else fake. I mean, fake. I mean, I'd like to see you do better, which you can't. And I just saw your video letting us know that you're being put up for adoption. <sighs> and that just makes me beyond happy. Probably makes the J Nation happy too. Probably makes the J Nation happy too. It's the only reason your parents are probably setting you up for adoption is because you're calling a different YouTuber fake and just continuously disrespecting him. And that's not cool, bro. Like, seriously. I want to sit down real fast. I mean, I mean, ZDL, I am a very faithful member of the J Nation, and I take full respect for J. And you don't. And I'm. And you're calling him fake, and that's not the right thing to do. Maybe you could just discuss terms at some sort of YouTube show or something like that. If only you could be as popular as Jay, which you'll never be. And... Yeah. <clears throat> but... But you're... But you're trying to expose him and call him... And... Call him Ruby... Call him... Him and other 3AM YouTubers such as... Jester, Ruby... And Ruby Rube Bake. It's not cool. It needs to stop right now. If you're... If you're such, if you think you're so, if you think you're so good and think that you could do better than him on YouTube, you're wrong. I mean you, I mean Jay has over more videos than you, number one more videos than you and number two more subscribers, and number two more subscribers than you, so you can't talk. If he, if he's fake, why does he have that much subscribers, huh? What makes you think that he's fake? If he has more subscribers and and more videos than you, he has more popularity, and you just wish that you could be friends with other YouTubers like Jay Station, take Stromedy, take Stromedy and Jay Hills for instance. They're his besties. Well, Jay, even though Jay Hills and he broke up later on to date, but now that they're back together, you wouldn't stand a chance now. Well, these apps are totally, totally real. I mean, they use the... I mean, if you go check out JayStation's video, they... Hang on, I'm trying to think. Um, hang on, I'm trying to think. They used a see-through app, and didn't it work? I mean, it's not humanly possible for an app to, th to see through a wall. To see through a wall or s somebody else's clothes. Though that was kind of weird what j Hills did at the end. That was just weird. Mm. But, are you trying to do better than Jay? It's not... ZDL, it's not happening. It's not happening. You... You, you don't even have, you can't even get or have more subscribers than him. It's more, more subscribers than him. You have only 1.9k subscribers 
and Jay Hills had and no Jay, I'm Jay Station has over four million. He hit four million just today. Go check it out. Go check out his channel if you haven't already. But but ZDL, you really need to start knowing knowing better of these of what choices you're making, like calling J Station fake and stuff like that. It's not cool. You need to learn better and make better choices. Like leaving J Station alone. I mean, he never called you fake, did he? So why are you calling him fake? Did he not inspire you when you watched his videos as a child? Did it really, like, you know, disappoint you? Is it really, like, what, a couple, a couple of good videos that J Station made that you can't even do? J Station's a professional. He learns this stuff. He learns this stuff. He, like, looks it up to see if it, like, works, gets it off of other YouTubers. And he's really good. I mean, if you want to call him fake, that's if you want to call him fake, that's your choice. That's your choice. If Jay, if you wanna, if you wanna like make videos and expose other three AM YouTubers, that's your choice. But if Jay Station wants to go ahead and inspire his fans by creating three AM challenges, that's his choice. But you didn't make the smart choice. You exposed him, calling him fake. And if he was if he would be exposed, then he wouldn't have as much subscribers as he does right now. Over forty, over four million, bro. It's not cool. But if you just do better, then you'll learn from J Station's from J Station's inspirement. If you watch his videos, then you'll learn better. Then you'll learn better. Don't worry, you'll learn eventually. Adoption. But it's not cool to call someone else fake. How would you feel if J Station called you fake? Eh? How would you feel? What would you say? Just leave him alone. I mean, you called him fake. He probably took notice and just completely left you alone, didn't he? But if he called, but if he called you fake and then tried to expose you, would you leave him alone? Heck no. But, just stop. It's getting on my nerves, and you're really taking off the rest of the J Station, the rest of the J Nation who watch your videos. So, yeah. The J Nation, the J Nation's only trying to stand his ground, and if you're calling, and it's hard for them to focus and enjoy J Station's videos and continuously become more and more inspired by what he does and what he's capable of when you're calling him fake. Just stop. I don't know how many times I've said that, but I feel like I need to say it hundreds of times just until you realize. But calling someone, calling some straight, calling some YouTuber that you don't know fake? Do you even know J Station? If you don't, then why are you then why are you trying to expose him and take away his popularity? Are you trying to spam his friends? Is that what you're, his fans? Is that what you're trying to do? Well, it ain't working. You only have 1.9, and Jay has flipping 4 million. And, yeah, I think we'll wrap it up there. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If anyone... Man, pick this up. If anyone has any issues with what ZDL vlogs and on, on what ZDL vlogs is doing, like exposing and calling J Station fake, make sure to leave a like on this video and comment down below what you think on what ZDL did. What, what do you think? What do you think of ZDL for exposing J stuff like that? Like, do you think it was? Do you think he's right? Or do you think he's just trying to scam scam him and try and threaten to steal his entire channel? Let me know in the comments below. I, that's something I desperately want to know. But I am a faithful member of the J Nation, and I will see all you guys later. Later. Goodbye, Rough David. 
2119 squad, and goodbye, whoever's watching on the J Nation.